Evening guys, happy homebrew Wednesday. This is my American IPA that I did a uh, recipe with Beersmith. Probably my best beer to date. Um, I won't do a review on it, I'll let others do that. I've given a couple of them to different people. Let them do the review, um, but I think it's good. Oh, right, quick shout out, Homebrew Marty. I um, watched a couple of his videos and he contacted me about possibly reviewing some of his homebrew. Um, I know one or two other homebrewers have subscribe to him since then who know me so if you subscribe to me if you can get over and check him out he's just started out on doing videos um, he does the all grain brewing amongst other things so that's homebrew marty get over and have a look right what have i got going on um Two weeks, nearly, nearly two weeks ago, I brewed an oatmeal stout. Excuse me. And this weekend, I'm going to bottle it. Um, and do my Christmas brew. And just use the yeast cake that's in the bottom of the fermenter I've done the Christmas brew straight on top because it's a stout style beer but we've added fruits and spices etc so that should be interesting I think Brewmaster Ben will be coming up to help with the brew which will be fun. So, Ben, if you're watching, we're on. Um, should be interesting. Should be interesting. Next Friday, I am at the Great British Beer Festival. Cannot wait. Cannot wait. So if you're going on the Friday, I might see you there. Um, should be a good day. Should be a good day. Today I visited the Fuller's Brewery. I didn't have a tour because we were just passing. So I popped in to the shop and got a few craft ales and a couple of glasses. So I'm looking forward to tasting those. Um, I will go back and have the tour, I think. Should be interesting. Should be an interesting uh, day out. I brewed up the Idle Valley Brewing English Bitter Kit. It's not quite ready yet. Um, I have tried one and I watched Harry Brew's videos about his English bitter and he said there was an astringent taste to it. Um, I wouldn't say it was astringent, it just doesn't taste quite ready yet. I don't know what that is. Very clear. I know Harry had problems with his clearing. I had no problems with mine clearing. I just think it's a bit young. It's only coming up to two weeks in the bottle so maybe give it a little bit longer. Um, bear in mind I did swap the yeast out so I'm using a different yeast than Brewmaster Ben did, so I just, to me it just doesn't taste quite ready yet. When it is, I'll up upload a review on it. Um, I think that's me. Just a quick one this week. A few updates. I'd, I'd like your thoughts actually on the Christmas brew, whether it would be okay just to 
dump it straight on the yeast cake from the oatmeal stout. Um, I've asked one or two people on Facebook and they seem to say it'll be okay, don't worry about it. But if you've had an experience of it, one person was a bit concerned about over pitching. If that's the case, let me know. Because I don't want to muck it up, I've got one crack at it. One crack at the Christmas brew, once it's it's in, it's in. Um, no other updates. I am done. I'm going to enjoy the rest of this. Mm. One more thing. Grant. Soon he's doing his first all grain. I just want to say good luck on your first all grain Grant. I'm sure you'll be fine. The amount of research you've done. Far more than I ever did. I'm sure you'll be fine mate. Um, but that's it. Right. Cheers guys. Enjoy the rest of the vids. And I'll see you soon.